Hello and welcome. Last time I was trying to put some detail down and I did this little riverside area and I was wondering what to do with it. And then I remembered there's the content creator packs which I've not really explored too much. And there were a couple I still haven't got at the time which I have bought now. So I'm thinking let's try it out. Um, where was it? Is it here? Yep. So I just bought the Japanese pack and I'm thinking maybe let's use that down the riverside here. So sort of like a mini Japanese area. Now how big are these things? They're going to take out some buildings aren't they? Uh, but I've got more space on this side so which one's that one? Drive-in restaurant? Okay you can go there. Um, that's a bit smaller. Let's just see which one's a big or small. So that's a bigger one. So that can go this side. What was that even? Noodle restaurant. So they're going to be competing a bit against each other here. Ramen. Everyone loves ramen. Service station. That is massive. Uh, don't think I want offices. Oriental market. We'll have one of those. Did I say drive-in? Yep, drive-in restaurant. So these are office buildings. Resort hotel. That is huge again. I may or may not encroach into this area later. Uh, Downtown Hotel. Yeah, that's not going to fit, is it? Unless I move some other stuff around. I don't think I'm with that. And what is that? Temple. Would I make a nice feature on the end, or should I just bunch it up with the rest of the stuff? But that will leave a bit of empty space there. Let's put it on the end for now. And yeah, these will be really out of place. Department store, massive. Whatever that is, massive. And that's a different set now. Okay, so that's the Japan set done. No, we don't want that. So how does that look then? Mm, not 100% sure about it since they got really massive car parks. So that would seem more fitting to me on a main road like the one behind than, than here. So I might swap them around actually. But if I do that, I still have the old problem. What do I put along here? That's a bit different. Well, people are certainly coming down to it. And okay, I didn't actually pay attention to this road crossing, but there's lots of people using it as well. Um, oh, look at that traffic. That could be improved. Is it time for a roundabout? there because I'm not sure this arrangement is really great is it get more connectivity to a roundabout might help before yeah I think I'll try putting a roundabout here in a second but there's enough people walking there that I'm thinking would a footpath be useful just um I hate snap. Just something like that. I don't know. Something like that. Just to give people another little shortcut. So if they want to go fro you know, from the bridge area to here, save some the loop around that block. Might take a little time for people to uh, catch up on that. 
I do wonder actually, whilst. Oh, do more of that. What do these. Entertainment. So they, these are touristy things. Okay. I was just wondering since they said offices, would they count as actual offices? I guess not. But um, yeah, definitely this I think would benefit from being a roundabout. Because that's a little, yeah, the two junctions close together don't help. So if I put a roundabout there, I'll try to get everything connected to that and hopefully eliminate this junction. This will probably have to move, but I can do that separately. Um, let's do it. Goodbye that road. And that and that. Is that enough room for us? I mean, I have to remember to put that back, otherwise this half of the city is not powered. Here we go. It's happening now. Do I want a small one or a large one? Because this is quite a major junction. How small is a small? I don't know. I mean, if it's going to be a large one, it should be further in anyway, because otherwise... We've got major junctions and minor junctions. I'm just wondering... How do we do this? got to delete more roads otherwise a snap is going to be annoying or I'll just do a small one because that will fit easy how do I rotate the thing again that way right let's try a small anyway I'll regret it later So we got that joining, we probably do want snap back on. We've got that joining there. I could make that asymmetric actually. Uh, where's it gone? Yeah. Actually, is there any point? We'll see how it works. Now, is that the same road type? Yes, it is. And then we want to... That might need a bit of a curve. Or was that the node anyway? I might lose a few buildings if I take... If I connect that over there... So back to the small road, not the one way, that one. Do I need to delete that? Should I just do that for now? Just as a placeholder. This is not final by any means, but just to just see what we got to play with. Because I'm deleting that as well. Nothing on here is critical, is it? I don't think. It's just random buildings. What is that corner shop? Something meat. Lateral fresh meat. Mm. So we break that. We break that and that. That joins to there once I put the road in. Uh, that might have to disappear. Hmm. Is that going to be too many junctions on a roundabout or not? 
Or is that going to be okay, do you think? Because that's the sole route in and out of that whole area now. And that is not going to survive, is it? I can't rotate it. It's not going to fit unless I put a side road in. Something like this. Got to stop doing that. Right. Would that be enough for it to go on there? Come on. Come on. Unless I want to move it further back that way. I'll leave the gap there. You know, it serves a bit of a space between that and this this middle zone there. Um, I mean, a footpath is hardly any saving now, is it, in travel distance? I mean, it is just a takes a corner off and I might upgrade this road later anyway to one that doesn't allow pedestrians. Speaking of which then I probably want to continue the footpath from this side. So if they can't walk on that anymore they still have a way to get around. Don't need those anymore. Uh, I can probably take that corner off just to give it a bit more. Am I going to do anything with that? I wonder. I probably shouldn't make that asymmetric for now. We'll see how that goes, because the other option is maybe this road will not get joined at the roundabout, but join somewhere else, like, you know, I could cut through there maybe and just move these around a bit. Let's see how that helps, if at all, on that junction. What happens? Uh, something doesn't look quite right there. There's junction signs, aren't there? No! Let's try again. So, nothing selected, right. That's one of the annoying things of the game. So we'll have the entrances to the roundabout stop signed, but not the exits. Does that help? Okay, it's starting to move a bit now, but that traffic, look at it. Oh, power, 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 power. I said I need to put it back, didn't I? I didn't put it back. Um, let's take it over this way. Just in case I want to tinker more of that stuff. Hopefully that will fix all that as well. That's a close one. Do I have some crime there? I haven't checked recently actually, you know, what the coverage is like. I've got one, two, three, four police stations. Is that enough? Uh, let's just see how busy this one is. All the cars are in use. Maybe I could do with another one at some point. Look at that. It's quite amusing in a way, isn't it? Mm. 
what have we got there? Too little or too much something. No, I'm not going to look at industry this time. Not this time anyway. Right. That's still not good enough, is it? And that's a lot of traffic getting stuck on that roundabout. Oh, they're stopping there because they can't move there. Right, let's see. Would it help if this was more lanes? We need more lanes. Um, six lane one way, or is that totally overkill? Or should I make it a highway? Does that help? It looks like it's moving. Might, it might be moving faster, is it? Or is that just my imagination? They're whizzing. It seems to be going faster, I think. But I'm not 100% sure. Right, oh. Look at that, all the way back to there. Is this even worse than it was before? There's one other option I got. What if I make the highway, well it's not even highway, what if I make the main road a flyover? It should be a highway if I'm going to do that though, I think. Because that's just not enough capacity, is it? That's not good enough. Unless I have fewer junctions. Fewer junctions might help. I don't think that's really big enough to become a highway. I mean, I'm kind of thinking they're not... It's always been a struggle in the vanilla game. They don't use all the lanes. I've got three lanes going round a roundabout, but people are only using the outside two. And on the feeder roads, look at that. They're coming. Oh, they're only using one lane out of the ones available. In real life, both lanes would be used, and you get a lot more throughput. Could I make it better? Because I'm thinking reducing the number of junctions could also help as well. Especially when they're all busy. If I break that feed, they'll have to come in this way, but that will be one less blockage. 
I'm going to try that for starters. Run away. So now they all have to filter through this way. But again, it's the same problem. They're not... Whoa, okay, that's a police car. I give you all these lanes, but you're only using one of them. I'm thinking, would increasing this to six lanes make any difference, or would they still be just as stupid? So how do I fix that one then? Yeah, the traffic is not pretty over there. If I put a path there, would they take that to join there, or would they actually go the back way? There's nothing else I can do over there, it's too far away. What would happen if I joined that to there-ish? Let's just try it and see what happens. Again, it will take a little bit of time for the traffic to sort itself out. Yeah, someone's... I just saw someone go that way. Yeah, that's still pretty ugly. It's... oh. You didn't see that. Yeah, this is worse than what I had already, isn't it? Right, let's... let's get rid of it. It's not working. There's just too much traffic for that to cope with. So, for starters, let's reconnect these. Now, I'm thinking, I'll, get, I'll do my earlier thought, which is, I'll leave that there. These can still join up, and it's still going to be a traffic jam. Uh, what am I doing? That one, that one, that one. So that is still going to be quite a jam. But I don't have the extra road there now, so that might flow a little bit better. Um, while I'm in this mode, let's just check. Do I want lights or not? Or should I just do that? In fact, same question here. Would this help with the flow? Just in general. Same on all of them. I probably should have just clicked the priority road option wherever that is. Is that full? Uh, doesn't matter. 
Um, right. And go. How's the traffic flow? There's lots of people trying to come off there. Because I'm thinking if I make even this stretch highway, that could help. Because it would be nice actually just to have a highway connection. Because at the moment they have to use these smaller roads to join a highway here. Oh, I can make this asymmetric again. Wrong way. That's the right way. Just to uh, give them a bit more chance to turn off. So you've got two lanes for turning. That should help with the flow a bit. Yeah, that's clearing up. Uh, this probably needs a bit more work. Do I have lights here as well? That one arguably is justifiable though. Because it's a three-way junction and all three ways are quite major. Now that one probably can go... Should I make that even a minor road? Yeah, I need to increase the capacity. Is that a candidate for a roundabout? Because unlike the other ones, there's only going to be three junctions on there. I'm not sure about these junctions as well. Is that just too many junctions on that bit of road? I'm just having a look now. Could I reduce that somehow? Because that's probably not a great idea either, is it? Having so many junctions on a main road, essentially. I mean, I could reverse that, for example, put that onto the industrial <coughs> industrial side. Let's just do it. And then disconnect it from this end. So that's one fewer junction there. Now, is there enough room for me to run a small road parallel to the main road? But then it's still going to be lots of junctions there. But it's n but it'll still reduce the number connecting to there, which is the goal. It's not going to like me, is it? I think that's just too short an area. What if I go with this side? Apparently I can do that. Oh no, I ruined all that stuff though. But if I delete that bit... Actually, if all the houses are gone anyway, I might as well just re... rescape that bit. Something like that. And I'm guessing this was low density housing. 
probably clean that up. Don't want to be on the main road. Let's just try that. I know that was nothing to do with it. Uh, oh, that's why I left it blank, didn't I? Probably should leave it blank. Oh, school's busy. Do I need more school capacity? I'll just let these people rebuild. How's traffic? Is that better now or not? I mean, that is still a jam. Should that be a six lane, not a four lane? I'm probably ruining all the road classifications here. Ah, it looks like they are using more of the lanes now. So that's good. Should I upgrade more of this to six then? Because this is a major through, through fair, through, well, whatever you, I can't say, you know what I mean. A major transport connection. That looks like it's done it. So, okay, it's still a bit of slowness on the roundabout. But they're sort of sorting themselves out now, aren't they? Kinda. <coughs> oh, I was gonna. How much can I. Is that too much or not? They still got road connection. I just want to put a little bit back in if I can, just to there. And then just tidy it up with a footpath. Just in case anyone wants to come from this side, it just makes it a bit easier. Why weren't they used? Um, okay, it's got busy again. Why did it just suddenly get busy? What am I looking for that one? So we still got the lights there. That probably won't make a huge difference anyway. Should I make this six as well? Because with the more increased lanes, it does seem to allow them to bunch up and move a lot more. Not perfect, but maybe slightly improved. I'm thinking if I disconnect that, say, all the traffic will have to then go this way. Am I just going to move the problem from there, that junction to that junction if I disconnect there? I think the answer is yes. The better solution might be to have another main road somewhere around here to this way. 
Oops. Oh, 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 okay. I forgot. I said I was going to add a road. I never did. So that's not connected at the moment. That's not going to help. Um, and I did say it's probably best if I say connected that one or that one. I'll have to move stuff either way. So which stuff do I want to move more? I mean, that's only one, I suppose. So if I move that, say, there. Just the normal road, straight down. Should I just bunch it up a bit? Actually, what I probably should do is make the road perpendicular from this side, at least to there. Yeah, that's the nearest node. Just make it a little bit squarer. Okay, that didn't really help, did it? Maybe the park can go separate. Just keep all these buildings together. Alright, so now you should be all connected again. Come on, crime and garbage, do your stuff. Just double check the road connections. Yeah, it should be fine. But yeah, that's flowing a lot better again. I mean, that's almost okay, isn't it? The flow. In that, it's actually flowing now. Well, that's the high street, was it? Because that's one of the other options. Instead of that connection there, I can maybe connect it down here. Organic food market, your days are numbered. Let's do it. So that road now has to bend over. Just messes up the commercial a little bit there. I'll take that one out. That'll be plenty. Maybe these will upgrade and... Oh, did I put those gaps in intentionally, actually? I think I did. Just to stop them from being... too regular. So they still have some connectivity there. I'm wondering if a little path here might or might not help at all. I really hate this snap. You know I'm putting down a footpath. Why are you making it so difficult for me? I can't leave out there, can I? It's just too horrible. It's 
something like that. I mean, I don't know. Would they actually go that way? But at least I have the option now. Maybe I should do the same on this side as well, just for another connection. There's not a huge amount of foot traffic in this area. But I'm just trying to improve this road traffic, is the main priority here. Partial success. That could go asymmetric. Could or should I make this into one giant roundabout? Should I do it? Six lane, one way road. I'm doing it. So the idea is this will become one giant roundabout. So the traffic doesn't try to cross over itself. It's done. We have the world's biggest roundabout. Does it help? I should take the lights off now because it's a roundabout. And yeah, technically the, the loop is the primary route. So that is the one that should have priority. I might have to take some of these off, otherwise it will just reduce the capacity too much. Yeah, this road is wasted, isn't it? There's six lanes. Four, oh, only two of which are turning off. That's a bit more sensible, I suppose. One turning down a small road, two going on, potentially, and that's okay, and the rest going round. I mean, yeah, six lanes is probably overkill, but it's a faster road, so you get a bit more effective capacity. I'm just still wondering if I should take the stop off there. I probably could actually. That will increase the flow from that side significantly. Oh, I think I should do something similar here as well. Should I make this six lane as well? Or at the least, just take out. The, let's take out the stops. And same on that one. They've got enough lanes. Hopefully, they don't collide too much of each other. Like this is where I kind of wish I used traffic manager. Because that would just help it not be so stupid.
but the traffic is moving. That might have done the trick. So this side is more or less okay. I mean, okay, still backing up a little bit, but that's because they only you have three lanes. What is everyone? Okay, they're in the middle one. Of course, that's what everyone does. So that is real life. You can have three lanes, but everyone will sit in the middle one. Use the other lanes. I'm th I am still wondering, should this be six lane as well? But it's not building back here too much, so I don't think I really need to. It's bugging up a little bit at this one now. Why is it doing that? Because people are trying to get to the industrial area and they're crossing paths. I should put a stop back in for that junction just to allow the people coming on well I mean coming this way to keep the priority up let's just see how bad this might or might not get I have one other pot potential option if it comes to that which is I could also make this a one way out only, out from a roundabout, and then I can have the connection to the roundabout go through this way. No, no, the traffic also conflicts. The traffic coming from this side will go that will be cut across by traffic if I did go this way up and across. They'll have to still cross each other anyway, so that wouldn't help. But I think it's manageable. Okay, it's still going all the way back there. Look, you've got three lanes. Use them. You've got more than three lanes, even. Uh. Round and round and round we go. Right, let's go back to here, which is what I was trying to fix earlier, and I think it's okay. This is okay now. So reduce the amount of connection in this area, and this is enough to cope with it. I think I really need another highway connection. I did say before, I wanted to keep this forest area largely untouched. I mean... I guess the question is, how much do I want to keep this industrial area? Will I build out this industrial area some more? That's the question I'm asking myself. And if I do... So the road comes in, hits that. We've got this smaller road just to take you to the far side of the city. I wanted to try to keep this forest area as undisturbed as I can, other than what I have already done. This is when I started the map. So 
so that is already a road connection to get to this area but I'm thinking do I need to bypass this area and go something like this because if I do that's another junction here that's probably going to mess things up or I could take the road straight up there mm. Then I'll need I'll, well I need to tidy tidy this up anyway. That's my freehand junction. It ain't pretty, but it works. And we got these three lanes, but they're all sitting in the middle lane. Why do you do that? Is there anything I can do to make it better? Because I think they're not using that lane because they're kind of saving it to turn off there. But they're not using that lane either. At all. <clears throat> Same problem again here. You've got three lanes but everyone's in one lane. Okay, as soon as I say that someone is using the middle lane but... Could do with more still. Okay, it's building up a little bit down there as well. That's because, yeah, because this isn't getting out fast enough. It's building up back here, which is... Okay. I think I might have to call it a day soon. What I'm thinking is... If I buy that, that and that tile, it's going to be three tiles I need, isn't it? That's a lot. One, two... I can get... Now, if I get that tile, there's not a great way to connect to here. I want a highway connection to this part of the map. How do I do that? And I'm thinking buying that, that and that square is the logical way to do it. Because I don't really have a highway access. I don't want to upgrade this to highway. Or do I? I don't think that would really solve this area problem. Use the lanes. Why don't you use the lanes? This would be... Tons of space if you did that. Is the other problem I have basically people in this area? Where are they actually? Where are these people coming from? Where's the traffic analysis thing? Okay, so it's mostly this area. If I had a faster connection to the highway there, would that encourage more people to use that? Rather than use that. Because the problem is... I never intended this to be a main road. It just ended up being one when I bought the highway over. And it's like if you're in this area here, you want to go to the highway, the logical choice is along there. This wouldn't actually be too bad, but because it's small road, I don't think they want to pick it. 
So I would have to upgrade this to a major road and probably demolish some stuff and get it connected down here. The other problem being, of course, I don't really... I mean, that, I can't move that. That's a cemetery. So I can't upgrade that road to a wider one. It won't let me. I don't really want to go through the forest, like I said many a time. I, I want to try preserving it. So it's not really a good solution though. I mean, I could upgrade this to a bigger road as well, but that would probably also need a ton of stuff would need moving as well. Not great. Lots of fish trucks, aren't they? Of course, because that's backed up, this is backed up. That does not help. I need that. I need that extra connection to the highway this side. I think that's the only logical solution. And I'm not big enough to unlock another square. Okay, so I can't do that yet. Because it's not just... How many is that? One, two, three, four, five... Is it nine you're allowed normally? So I'll have to unlock two more squares before I can do a south connection. But it does let me plan a little bit. I'll want to bring a highway I mean this area here you know I think this is a natural point for a highway to cross so just a little bridge there highway into this area and that will give the industry traffic from this side somewhere to go as well because at the moment they have to go through all this stuff And I don't see an easy way out of this. Uh, there's one option that could make things better or it could make things a lot worse. And I might not have unlocked it yet. Passengers, cargo harbour. I need more population first. I don't want ferries. I was thinking, uh, you know, a, a, a ferry connection might help. The other option is rail. Now, I've already bought this square. If I hadn't bought the square, then... No. The problem is, if I did buy these two to access for more directly, there's not really a good logical crossing point to here. I mean, I could go across there, I suppose, but that was not intended to be a highway connection. So this is still the more logical crossing point. Okay, I think I will end here. So lots of traffic planning uh, to be considered for the future and instead I guess what I need to do is continue with the city growth and unlock more features and hopefully allow me to buy those extra squares or that connection but I also have to grow in a way that doesn't increase demand where there's some congestion already but that's for another day for now that's enough for one video Thanks for watching, see you next time.